Welcome to another session from LearnReason.com. My name is Matt. This video is sponsored by HDRefills.com. Hear and feel the difference. Go check them out. You'll be glad you did. Today on Shortcut Sunday at LearnReason.com, I'm going to show you how to nudge a clip or clips. There are three ways that this can be done. First, I'll show you how to nudge a clip to the snap unit setting. The snap unit setting would be right up here. You have bar all the way up to 164. So if you select a clip and you have it set at bar and you press the command key or the control key and either the right or left arrow, you can nudge it and it's going to nudge to one bar because that is the snap unit setting. So if I go to 164th, it will nudge 164th. That's the setting of the snap, that's the snap unit setting. Now if you want to, if you want to select, um, you want to nudge a bunch, all you do is you select all the clips and you nudge them just the same way you would do one right or left. Okay, the next way to nudge a clip or clips in Reason 9 is by one beat and that's going to be the setting right up here. One beat and that is shift command or shift control. And if you watch right up here you're going to see the beat marker move one. Moving one beat left or right. And you can do this, of course, with all clips. Want to move all of them one beat forward? Boom. That simple. That's shift command or uh, shift control uh, arrows. Simple as that. And the third way that you can nudge a clip is by one tick. And this is going to be like the, the most minimal way that you can just nudge it just to probably get that perfect timing or, or you know that most intricate nudge and that number is going to be right up here you can watch this number it's going to be hard to see the clip move one tick but the way you do it is you hold down option command or alt control and use the arrows select the clip and move it by one tick and you can see it's moving by one tick now, if I hold it down, you'll start to actually see it move, but believe me, it is moving one tick. And, of course, you can select all of them and move them all one tick. They're all moving one tick. <laughs> so, that is how you nudge clips in Reason 9. I hope this helped you guys out, and as always, the way you can help me out is liking, subscribing, or uh, you know, telling people about our, our our website and Facebook page and social networks. So you guys all take care, and I look forward to seeing you the next time on Shortcut Sundays. Take care, everybody.